Hey, Shalom, Markim. Just a quick commentary, right? Uh, real quick. Um, I just typed in uh, right here, uh, Grecian. Um, and this is a follow up on the video that I did on the Gentiles just now, you know, the dispersed among the Gentiles. Uh, all praises to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shai, Bashim, Rakal, Kudash, double honors to the apostles and the elders, great millstone that rule well, blessings to the whole full elect. And I'm just going to break down this word real quick right here, man. For those of you brothers that don't know what the term Grecian means, because the word Grecian. Um, is actually in the scriptures, man. All right, so we're going to read it. It says, the term Grecian or Hellenist denotes a Jew by birth or religion who spoke Greek. It is used chiefly of foreign Jews and proselytes. In um, Proselyte means uh, newly come to the faith. In contrast with the Hebrews speaking the vernacular Hebrew or Aramean, right? A Bible dictionary of tract society. So the term Grecian or Hellenist <clears throat> it's just basically a, a, a Greek speaking Jew, okay, and that's what you got to understand, and that's why the scriptures speak about when you go into the scriptures, all right, and you, 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 you know, in fact, I was on that, uh, uh John 19 and 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 19. What was the inscription that was written on uh, on uh, on the cross of Yahweh Shai? It says it was written in the Hebrew, the Greek, and the Latin because you had Greek speaking Jews, man, all right, and then I brought out in Acts, uh, the sixth chapter as well. It says, in those days, Acts 6 and 1, and in those days when the number of the disciples were multiplied, there arose a murmuring of the Grecians against the Hebrews because their widows were neglected in the daily ministration. When you go into that word Grecians, I believe the word there uh, is Hellenistas, okay? Which basically says, what well, a Hellenist, one who imitates the manners and customs or worship of the Greeks and use of the Greek tongue. It's the same thing. Used in the New Testament of Jews born in foreign lands and speaking Greek. Okay, and that lines up perfectly with this um, definition right here that you can see on Google. All right, the Bible study tools. It said the term Grecian is, uh, or Hellenist, Grecian or Hellenist, all right, or Hellenistas, all right, denotes a Jew by birth or religion who spoke Greek. Okay. Foreign Jews and proselytes, okay? So what you got to understand is, that's why the scripture said in John 7 and 35, when you go to the dispersed among the Gentiles and teach the Gentiles, and that word for Gentiles in John 7 and 35, like I just went into, was talking about the Helen, okay? Which is basically, um, you know, the dispersed among the Greeks, all right? And teach the Greeks, all right? Because there was Greek-speaking uh, Jews, but they didn't necessarily know that they were Israelites, so they had to be taught, all right? So with that, man, Lord willing, that was edifying for you, brothers. Um, and I'm going to close it out, man. Shalom.